I ain't really find nothing. I spent too much money on this asshole. But this it though. I I'm gonna go play this it. Don't look at the website and film at the same time. That's I had to take a break for a second. It only took me about five minutes to do that. Your girl was shopping, okay? Your girl was shopping. That's all I can say. Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. This is the mixed edition. If this is your first time here, I cover a mixture of things, all things beauty and lifestyle. So if that is your jam, make sure you jam that subscribe button and join the mix. Now guys, this is part two of my Bath and Body Works sass haul. Okay, we was getting real sassy in part one, so I hope you guys tuned in for that one. Remember, I'm doing two giveaways, one in part one and one in this video for part two. So guys, make sure you watch the whole video all the way through because I don't know when I'm going to let you guys know what I'm going to be giving away, plus the details for how to enter the giveaway. So guys, part one was all about the body care, the fine fragrance mist, the body creams, the lotions, the body showers. This one, part two, is going to be all about pretty much everything else that smells good, like your wallflowers, your candles, your room sprays. So we're about to get into it. So I'm super excited. Let's go. Hold up, guys. I'm making another order. I'm making another order while I'm shooting the video. This is so crazy. I just saw that they had their candles drop to their single wick candles. They drop to 75% off. So you can get a single wick candle for under $5. Yeah, so hold hold that thought. Let me let me um I'm gonna come back to these candles, but I gotta order these candles before these candles get gone. So I'll be right back, y'all. <laughs> yeah, so we're definitely gonna have a part three, okay? I just I saw them single wick candles go to 75%. Yeah, I had to grab me some. So let's get back into this haul. <laughs> And we are going to start with this bag right here. This bag is full of wallflowers. I have been obsessed with wallflowers. Like I just want to walk into my home and it already be filled with like aromas, you know, just uh it that sense just kind of like just transports you take you away it's just that aromatherapy so i just want to make sure my house is smelling good stuff is smelling good my body's smelling good everything's smelling good okay so i have been picking up wallflowers every single order that i've placed every single time i go into a store i just been picking them up so here's my little bag is actually a lot in here <laughs> so let's get into it okay so we're gonna talk about this scent a little bit later it's so funny that i picked this is the first one that i picked up but we're gonna talk about this scent a little bit later but the first one is wild rose and suede and i got the brightest bloom that brightest bloom well wallflower everything guys okay we got blush amber and peony i don't know what this smells like so i'm excited to get around to that flower child why nobody told me about flower child why y'all didn't tell me flower child is a whole vibe okay if you like floral just very oh god I can't even explain this. It's a floral, I mean, flower child, okay? What else could it be? But 
this baby in your house, it's like floral, florally, it's like floral, powdery, fresh, just, ah, uh, it's so good. Clean, fresh, floral scent. It's so good, guys. Like, I had to pick up a few more of these because when I smelled it, I was like, uh-uh, where have I been? So this is probably like my favorite wallflower right now. I got the Tahiti Island Dream. So once I put on, you know, the body shower and all the, the body care, I'm going to be putting this wallflower in just to catch the whole full vibe. So I can't wait to use this. I have Vanilla Cloud. I can guess what it smells like, but I don't think I've ever had this one before. I'm not sure. Water Lemonade. Guys, let me tell you. I did not think I was going to like this one, but this is so good. You smell way more of the watermelon than the lemonade, and this is just like perfect for summer. I'm currently using this one, and I have it in one of the um, scent-controlled uh, plugins, and I just been it's it's almost mm, it's almost down to like a quarter of the way. So once it's finished, I'm putting this one right back in there so I can just continue in the vibe. Here's another floral child. I have one in the laundry day. I don't. I don't know what laundry day smells like, but I can guess because I stay doing laundry. So we, we, the house smell like laundry anyway, all the time, but this would just add on to it. So I can't wait to use this one. I got cucumber melon, guys. You got to get the classics. Come on now. And for the summer, yes, cucumber definitely i got white t-shirt i have smelled this before i can't remember but obviously it's a fresh clean type of scent so love that for the house um i got another one in the wild rose and suede again we're gonna talk about this scent a little bit later i have an aloha Ki kiwi passion fruit I think I smell this in the store. I'm not 100% positive. It comes in this color and another color in the same scent. So yeah, I picked up one of those. Uh-oh, and here goes another Wild Rose and Suede. I guess you guys can guess that I'm really feeling that scent right now. Okay, so that's it. That was one, two, oh, let me count with one second, guys. Let me organize this so we picked up a total of 14 wallflowers um i love that i just got a an array of different scents so i can kind of you know just keep it fresh in here you know fresh but also just like with a brand new scent so i'm not just getting nose blind to um the scents that i go to Y'all, I got this big old bag. Oh, shit. It's so heavy. Ugh. Yeah. Okay, guys. So, I pulled some stuff out of the bag so I don't have that big old bag in front of my face like that. And we are going to go with the foaming hand soap next. This is the refillable foaming hand soaps. I love these, okay? I love the foaming hand soap because I just like how they feel. I feel like when it foams up, it grabs onto the dirt and, you know, just takes it off. And plus, these foaming hand soaps, they do leave your hands pretty soft. So, I really enjoy these. And in my household, we are always washing our hands, okay? We don't play about the hands, so y'all might see my hands ashy in a few videos because I'm always washing my hands. Like before I do anything, you know, I'm moving to the next situation. I gotta wash my hands. I gotta keep these hands clean, okay? And I got, I'm in here with old boys, okay? So we we washing all the time. Gotta gotta keep it clean. So yeah, but I picked up a few. I got this one in the Waikiki Beach Coconut. I have not smelled this since. 
I think they had it in like a candle too. I'm not 100% sure. But um, I picked up two of these in the same scent. I have one in the crisp morning air. And I have one in my favorite foaming hand soap. This is in the fresh cut lilacs. Like this, your hands, okay, you put this, wash your hands with this, it just fill the whole space, like your whole scent bubble. So I love this one. This is probably my favorite scent. I believe these were $6.97. Um, so I think they were 50% off. But um, if they go lower than $6.97, Again, we will be having a part three and maybe a part four, but um, I picked up just a total of four of these refillable foaming hand soaps for $6.97 a piece. Next, guys, I don't know, I don't know, we shaking the bag, let me get it out the bag so we ain't making a whole rock of noise. Next, I want to talk about room sprays. I just recently got back into room sprays. I used to have them back in the day, and then, you know, I don't know. I just leaned more towards my candles, and I just wasn't really dealing with the room sprays too much. Because, like, once they, because I'm a heavy sprayer, okay? <laughs> so, like, full sprays I'm, is already done. The room spray is done. So I kind of backed off room sprays for a second, but now I'm back into it and I'm going to start with the ones that I got on sale and then we'll get to the ones that I picked up just because. So the ones that were on sale is the, you guessed it, Fresh Cut Lilacs. Guys, this is like my, one of my favorite like home scents okay and one of the reasons why i love it so much is because let's say you cook in broccoli or greens or something that's like really pungent and fills your home you spray this fresh cut lilac and it's going to cut through that scent baby it is going to cut through that scent so that's why i keep a fresh cut lilacs uh candle or now i got the room spray or you know just the foaming um hand wash because it really does like the scent is so strong that it just cuts through every other scent that you may have going on so yes these room sprays were oh don't give me the lion okay i just don't get me the lion I, they were definitely under five dollars <laughs> so um yeah i just i just scooped them up just scooped them up the other one that I, the other one that i got that may or may not have been on sale but i did get it for the sale price i got the poolside cabana this smells definitely like poolside i would say this will be like at a five-star hotel and maybe your hotel is facing the pool and you know you go downstairs in your little bikini or whatever your little sunscreen and you just sit in poolside getting a little tan on yeah and the beach is over there so you're getting that ocean breeze as well as you know just sitting by the pool drinking a little pina colada yes this what that smells like. It smells more like pina colada banana, banana y. So I love it. It's fun and it also fills the room really good and it leaves a really good scent trail. So love the poolside cabana. The other two that weren't a part of SAS, it wasn't part of the sale, but I just picked them up anyway while I'm just shopping, okay? I picked up Beach Blanket. And I picked up Tropical Cherry Colada. Now, Beach Blanket, definitely, again, like if you are at a beach house, like on an island somewhere, and you just walk outside and you want to sit down and enjoy the nice breeze coming off the water, 
yeah this is what that smells like so we definitely gonna put some good use to this this is definitely gonna be one of the moments where i'm like i just spray it and i just transport myself and it's just a little little aromatherapy in a little bottle <laughs> The next one I got that wasn't on sale, but I got these two for 16 is the Tropical Cherry Colada. Now, let me, let me, smell, let me, let me try to smell that again. See, when you, see, this, the room sprays, when you spray it, it just take off like a rocket. So, guys, this one is okay. I'm not really sure about this one. Yeah, it's just okay, guys. I, I don't know. It, it's too synthetic, the cherry. But it's cool. Two for 16. I had to pick up another one. Next up, guys, I was influenced to buy this. I got influenced by Miss So Delicious here on YouTube. I love her channel. If you guys haven't checked her out, she does massive hauls, okay? Be sure to go check her out. Um, I was watching her channel, and she was talking about... Bath and Body Works laundry detergent. And back in the day, I think I may have had like one or two, but I never really got into it, into it. So I said, mm, let me go ahead and try one to refresh my memory, okay? And my clothes. So I picked up just one. I probably will pick up more depending on how I like this fragrance. Um, the one she talked about that she liked a lot was Morning Rain. So I picked this bad boy up. This is what it looks like. This is 32 fluid ounces. Um, this is fabric care detergent in the scent Morning Rain. The uh, notes are orange flower, soft musk, and fresh raindrops. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> um, washes up to 64 loads. And yeah. Squeeze sides of cap and twist to open. We're going to open this up because I'm curious to see what it smells like. I hope I don't fall in love with this because this is... I don't need nothing else to be obsessed with and that's my work. So I'm just going to open it because I'm going to do a sniff test. I like how the bottles are. They're very ergonomical in the hand. Okay. It smells good. It smells dewy, musky. I'm sure it smells really good like once you take your clothes out of the dryer this will probably smell really really good so i'm excited to try this but i only picked one of these up i believe it was a little less than ten dollars i think it was right at like nine dollars and 97 cent so ten dollars basically right so i think 32 ounces for ten dollars and we're going to see how good it's smelling, but not bad, okay? Drum roll, please. We are about to move into the finale, okay? This is all about the candles. <laughs> I smelled a lot of candles while I was inside of Bath and Body Works. It was insane, okay? Um, all of these candles that I'm about to talk about, I got them for $10.95. So... Not bad, I guess, but I guess that's as good as we're going to get for the candles. If these three wick candles that I'm about to show y'all drop to 75%, I will be doing a price adjustment for sure, okay? We're definitely doing price adjustments. It's not happening, okay? So let's get into it, guys. I'm just going to go with the easiest one to talk about. This is Brightest Bloom. Guys, I picked up only one of these i don't know why but i love this scent 
this scent has been in heavy rotation. I got the wallflower. I got the fine fragrance mist, the body cream, the body scrub. I got it all in this uh, fragrance line. So the candle, I mean, I think that was one of the only things that I had remaining on the list that I didn't get. So definitely during SAS, I had to pick up one. I really need to pick up another one, but you know what? I just bought two of the single wick because they dropped down to under $5. So I got two more in the single wick coming, but um, in the three wick, I only got this one. It smells so good, guys. I can't wait to burn it just to kind of see, you know, how, how it does in the air, like how strong it is. Um, it doesn't smell super strong when I'm doing it like that, but obviously the scent profile is something that I love, so I would have grabbed it anyway. This next candle, guys, why ain't nobody tell me? <laughs> why ain't nobody tell me that this fragrance was out here and doing what it's doing? The next one I wanna show and talk to you guys about is a Wild Rose and Suede. Now, you guys saw it during the wallflowers that I picked up three wallflowers in this fragrance. When I smelled this candle, it was love at first sniff, okay? Let me get into the notes real quick. Pink tea rose, soft suede, and warm amber. Pink tea rose and soft suede? Come on. Oh, my God. Y'all, just, oh my God. I am lost for words. When I smell it in this jar, I just want to, I just want to be in the jar. I want to get in here and be surrounded. I have burned this already. I don't know if you guys could see. I didn't already start to eat this one down. Okay, I burn candles pretty much all day long, all day long. I got the wallflowers going, I got the candles going, I'm going, okay, it's just a vibe. I, I, I have to have my aromatherapy, okay? This, oh, it's so good. I think I might have to get some more because I just, okay, so let me back up. When I burn the candle, it's not super, super strong. Like you can smell it, you could tell something is 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 nice, you know, a nice smell, a nice aroma, but it's not like, damn girl, you got that candle going, that smell good. It's not like that, but it's like, hmm, something, you know, it smell nice up in here. But I think this will do good in very close proximity. Like if you are taking a bubble bath or if you're just in your bedroom where it can like kind of enclose, um, you know, the scent trail, the scent bubble. I think this will do good in like small spaces. But all I need to do is really just take this cap off and I'm, I'm immediately in my aromatherapy. I'm a, immediately in my vibe, okay? It smells so good, guys. That tea rose with that suede. It just smells like super, like a silky rose. Oh, a silky satin rose. Mmm. The warm amber, I really can't even smell it. It's really all about this suede and this tea rose. And it just got me in a chokehold. So, I picked up, in total, four. I got four of the wild rose and suede. Now, guys... I am going to be giving away a candle and a wallflower to one of my lucky subscribers. So yes, 
this is the giveaway for part two of the sass haul and my videos make sure you leave a comment and that you are subscribed to the channel that is all you need to do for entry leave me a comment drop your ig so i can reach out to the lucky winner guys thank you so much in advance for just all your support all your love and I wish you all the best of luck for this giveaway. And if you haven't caught part one's giveaway, make sure you watch that video so you can get the details and get what is going on over there for that giveaway. But last thing in this haul is this candle right here. Another love. At first sniff. This is one of their blends, the Plumeria and the Sugar Lemon Zest. Okay, this, mm, I, I, Lord have mercy, that sugared lemon zest. Oh my gosh, with the plump, sweet, sugary, bright, fruity, it's everything, guys. It was love at first sniff, and I didn't already ate one of them down, okay? We are only 15 days in to the sale. Guys, this one is still hot. I don't know if you can see the wax moving. But I just pretty much stopped burning this when I started filming this. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, I wanted to show you that I already ate one of these down. Okay. So, yeah, I had to go ahead and get me some backups. So, I got a one. I got a two. I got three backups. So, that's four in total for this blend of the Plumeria and the Sugared Lemon Zest. Guys, that does it for part two of my Bath and Body Works Summer Semi-Annual Haul. I will definitely have a part three, but please be sure that you enter the two giveaways that I'm running, one for part one and one for this video, part two. We might get a part three, we don't know. But I am so excited for you guys, whoever wins this. I'm so excited and I'm just excited to continue to grow my community here. I'm trying to get to 500 subscribers, guys. So let's get it let's get it going let's get it popping because when we get to 500 subscribers baby we going up we doing bigger and better things we got things to do and i got things to do with you so again thank you guys so much be sure to like comment and subscribe and enter those giveaways love you guys mwah, mwah, mwah.